Hello, my name is Thomas Urso, head instructor at Asian Sword Arts of South Carolina. Today I will discuss the difference in martial arts styles. There are many, many differences in the martial arts due to a myriad of, uh, of subjects, culture, um, time period, uh, stressing different attacks, whether it's single person, multiple, uh, the time period, was it during the feudal era? Is it more modern self-defense? So again, there's a whole lot of differences. Today I will focus on some very, very basic differences. Um, <clears throat> I classify martial arts into three categories. You have weapons, you have striking, and you have grappling. Okay? Weapons are pretty obvious, whether it's a sword, uh, nunchucks, uh, staff, Basically, the, the weapon is an extension of yourself, so you can have more reach. Striking. Striking. A whole bunch of different uh, ways to strike. For example, you want it, you're at a further distance, so you use your legs. You kick with your legs. Okay? <clears throat> you're a little bit closer, so you use your hands. Whether it's coming in, striking like boxing, whether it's coming in and attacking, more, uh, more of an Asian approach, okay. and very, very close. You start striking with elbows, knees. Okay. Once you've broken that gap, now enters the grappling stage. From here, is someone would throw a punch, okay, coming down and doing joint manipulation. Okay. <clears throat> throw it again. Okay. Again, regardless if it's going to the ground or if it's an arresting technique, it's still grappling. From the different cultures, you have many different martial arts. For example, from China, you have the very famous systems that stem from the Shaolin Monastery, which include not only striking arts, which use hand and feet, but also weapons such as the broadsword, such as uh, the staff. <clears throat> from Japan, you have the very popular judo, which is essentially wrestling, uh, kendo, which is dueling uh, with a sword, uh, karate, which is essentially kicking and punching. From Korea, you have taekwondo, which is also very, uh, which is also very similar to karate in that it is a striking art. You have hakido, which is a little bit of a combination of striking and joint manipulation, uh, and you have. Uh, a somewhat obscured art called Shipargi, which is uh, a, a feudal era martial art which incorporates uh, 18 different yeah, systems, which include uh, weaponry and striking. Taekwondo, very famous for its rapid kicking. Hapkido, famous for its joint manipulation. Chinese style, such as Kung Fu, where the attacks come and they're more punch, they're more flowing in their motions. Once again, my name is Thomas Urso, head instructor at Asian Sword Arts of South Carolina, and today I discussed the difference in martial arts styles.